Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we're looking into a common nightmare for Android users, the dreaded black screen of death. Before you chuck your phone out the window, let's troubleshoot this issue together. Okay, you're swiping through your phone and out of nowhere it just goes black. No lock screen, no response to your touch. It's just like it's given up on life. But don't panic yet. So what is this black screen of death all about? It's basically your Android throwing a serious fit. It could be a power issue, a rogue app, or, fingers crossed not, a hardware malfunction. But whatever it is, we've got some things you can try before you start looking for a new phone. First up, is your screen actually broken? If your phone's playing sounds but showing you nothing but darkness, you might just need a screen repair. You can try connecting the phone to an external monitor to check for this. If the image works perfectly hooked up to an external display, there's a good chance the screen itself is malfunctioning. The next fix is all about battery life. Make sure your phone's charged up, and if you haven't charged it in a long time, give it a good half hour before expecting signs of life. And check the cables and ports while you're at it. Now we have to talk about security issues. Run a malware check because some nasty bugs could be messing with your screen. This obviously applies when your screen works intermittently and goes black randomly for no apparent reason. Otherwise, how would you run a malware check, right? Next, Outdated apps and Android versions can lead to a lot of black nothingness and other bugs. So make sure you update all your apps and that you're running the latest version of Android for your phone. If an app update doesn't fix it, maybe it's time to say goodbye to the app. Buggy and incompatible apps are not your friends. If your screen only goes black while using a particular app or you suspect an app running in the background, get rid of it. You can also try booting in safe mode, which lets you figure out if a third-party app is in fact the culprit behind those screen shenanigans. Another issue might be custom ROMs and kernels. If you've been playing Tech Wizard with your phone OS, it might just be backfiring and getting it back to the factory standard could be the solution. You can also try to wipe the cache partition to clear out any digital clutter that could be causing trouble. Clearing the cache is a common fix for many different problems, and a black screen could be one of them. And finally, do a factory reset. Yes, it's the nuclear option. It wipes everything from your phone, so back up your data before you go down this road. It might not fix the issue, but if you're sending your phone in for repairs anyway, you'll have to do it one way or another. So there you have it, several potential solutions to fix the black screen of death issue. If you want to know how to do some of these fixes, be sure to check out the article linked in the description below. See you next time.